Craig Jones didn't gravitate to the game of basketball until he got to Webster High School. I didn't really play um, that much basketball until I was maybe a sophomore in high school. And then I started playing and um, kind of doing well at it. I think my senior year in high school, um, I made all greater Rochester. And some of the local high school coaches didn't think I was that deserving of, of that. So I think that kind of motivated me. But in his first season at RIT, Jones only averaged about eight points and six rebounds a game. The most dramatic improvement I've ever seen in a player here at RIT was between his freshman and sophomore year. And he just got in the gym, he got in the weight room, he played against the very best around here, and he came back as a sophomore, uh, obviously as an All-American. His career took off from there. Jones was a three-time All-American and earned Division III Player of the Year honors in 1996, en route to becoming RIT's all-time leader in points and rebounds. Did you expect him to have the sort of career that he ended up having here at RIT? Uh, honestly, no. If you ever watch Craig play, whether it be in college or high school, he might not impress you with all the, you know, dazzle and, and glitz. Uh, he just got the job done. How much do those records mean to you? It's an honor for our whole team to have those because, you know, we played together and they were a huge part of my success. And so I think the records are, are nice to have. I don't think they'll, they'll always be there. You know, as Coach McVeigh said, there is a player right now playing that might come pretty close to that scoring record. So, um, you know, records are made to be broken and it's nice, but I don't expect them to be there, you know, years down the road. Earlier today at the Clark Gym in front of his former coach, teammates, family and Tiger Faithful, Craig Jones's number 33 jersey was retired. I think it's the most prestigious honor to, for an athlete to have. Um, you know, the three-time All-Americans, Player of the Year. I think it's, 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 it's the most prestigious honor to have to, for your university to think that much of you to retire your jersey. To me, to retire someone's jersey, um, that, is, that is really something special. Uh, it's not going to happen every year, um, and it's taken this long to, to really have someone that I felt and, and the staff and the committee felt was certainly more than deserving. It's really gratifying to me to see those guys come back. Uh, it's uh, hard to believe it's been 20 years uh, with their families, uh, and uh, that's kind of what it's all about. Uh, you know, seeing alumni being successful, um, and to honor one of our very best and to have uh, those people come back will be a very special day. It's special. Um, as I said, probably the biggest things I miss is college and, and college basketball, and we were a family, and I just think it's nice that, um, that we're all going to get back together again.